The Earth is made out of many things. We know here one by one with starting from Earth's center. So what is Earth made of? Deep inside Earth, near its center, lies Earth's core which is mostly made up of nickel and iron. The temperature at the inner core's surface is estimated to be approximately 5430 degrees Celsius, which is about the temperature at the surface of the Sun. It is primarily a solid ball with a radius of about 1220 kilometers. This inner core is lies deep inside between 5100 to 6378 kilometers. Earth's outer core is a fluid layer about 2,400 km thick, that lies above Earth's solid inner core and below its mantle between 2,900 to 5,100 km. Estimates for the temperature of the outer core are about 2,730 to 4,230 degrees Celsius in its outer region and 3,730 to 7,730 degrees Celsius near the inner core. Its mantle, which is made up of rock containing silicon, iron, magnesium, aluminum, oxygen and other minerals. The lower mantle, historically also known as the mesosphere, represents approximately 56% of Earth's total volume, and is the region from 660 to 2,900 km below Earth's surface. The temperature of the lower mantle ranges from 1,686 degrees C at the topmost layer to 2,357 degrees C at a depth of 2,700 kilometers. The upper mantle of Earth is a very thick layer of rock inside the planet, which begins just beneath the crust at about 10 kilometers under the oceans and about 35 kilometers under the continents and ends at the top of the lower mantle at 660 kilometers. Temperatures range from approximately 200 degrees Celsius at the upper boundary with the crust to approximately 900 degrees Celsius at the boundary with the lower mantle. The rocky surface layer of Earth, called the crust, is made up of mostly oxygen, silicon, aluminum, iron, calcium, sodium, potassium and magnesium. Earth's crust is a shell on the outside of Earth, accounting for less than 1% of Earth's volume. The average thickness of the crust is about 15 km to 20 km. Earth's surface is mainly covered with liquid water. Atmosphere is mainly nitrogen and oxygen, with smaller amounts of carbon dioxide, water vapor and other gases. The Kerman line, at 100 km or 1.57% of Earth's radius, is often used as the border between the atmosphere and outer space. 